both of you, leave me alone. Leave me alone, please. Ah ah, peanuts. I want to that? be daring, baby, no. dance the night away. I let my hair no. down no, if I want. So there's this little guy. Don't you just get tired just chasing fame and being pretty yeah, all the time? Hand. Doesn't sound like fun. Okay, so I think I'm going to do this. It's going to be super awkward. You can do better. Let me show you what a good time looks like. You can do better. Oh, sorry. So much better. Sorry. Hola, hi, we're 30 here. Uh, it's been, I was gonna say it's been a while since we did a sit down video, but that's not true. But the last sit down video we did has something to do with this sit down video we're doing today. So, win win, I guess. Hello, how are you? I hope you're doing great. Oh my god, I have missed you so much. What? Oh my, you know, I thought I was vlogging while we're in production, so we just finished uh, production of our second film, or I've just wrapped the production of the second film that I was involved in, and let me tell you, it's been a crazy two weeks. A lot has happened in those two weeks that I think everything just got jumbled up. Anyway, so this video is in regards to my dating myself series. I remember when the year began I told you that this year I'm going to be dating myself and someone or some people have asked after I posted like my first um, date which was like me celebrating something there's someone who mentioned that they want to also do the series but they don't know what to do and then another person um, left a comment in a video a previous video and they asked if I could possibly share some date ideas so like this has come up even on insta stories when I shared people are like hey um, I also want to do this series so I was like okay if someone also oh, I would also want to date myself rather so I was like if someone wants to date themselves as well since I'm giving myself enough time to plan I was like it wouldn't be fair for someone who also wants to participate in the same to have to wait for me to go on a date for them to pick that up as an idea so I was like let me put together a list of ideas on dates that you can go for so Today is the 17th of Feb. Have I done my Feb date yet? No. Am I going to do it? Yes. And not only am I going to be going for that date, I am going to also go on another date. Or I'm also going to have another date because I have decided that I deserve more than one date a month. I just, I was just like, no, one is not enough. I think, I think I want to have at least two dates a month. So what I did is I came up with an idea. This idea is to have two dates every month but then what I'm going to do is I'm going to separate the dates so the first date is going to be a date that's like you know me leaving the house me going somewhere uh, it's going to be I, I, I called it outsiding <laughs> Uh, yeah, so date one is outsiding, then date two is going to be an at home kind of date, something you can do at home so um, your kind sis decided to put together a whole entire list of 50 dates 25 of the dates are outsiding and then the other 25 are insiding <laughs> or at home dates okay so my date chart is going to change what i've decided is i'm going to remove all the dates I've, i took them out and wrote them down as well um, on this list and then added a couple more what I'm going to do is I'm going to have, my jar is going to have two different colored papers. So I'm going to write them on, say, sticky notes. And I'm going to pick um, two different colors because at least those are colored. And then when I'm planning my stay at home date, they'll have one color. And my outsiding date will have a separate color. I would recommend keeping a notebook uh, next to you. Like you can get a notebook and just write this down. Um, that's going to be helpful. Peanut, you're a grown ass dog. We're not gonna play these games. You're not a puppy. This one is a puppy. Go play over there. Ah, peanut over here. Like, ah, 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 ah. One of the date ideas that I have is to take a class. So these ones you can write them out in like different specific classes. You can take a cooking class. You can take a dancing class. You can take a pottery class. You can go uh, even like those painting classes. And I'm sure you can find a lot of them online. The beauty of taking a class is you are exposing yourself to something new or you're learning from someone. Like it's just a good way to just go connect with other people. You'll see other people in the class. You'll meet people. But then you get to learn something and like learn a new skill in this case 
then the second one is to get a spa treatment the spa treatment can also be different kinds of spa treatments you can go for a facial um, spa treatment you can go for a full body massage for a deep tissue massage or you can just go for like an actual massage you can go to a sauna and just go sweat all the gunk and whatever out you can go to those spas that do like the mud bath that outsiding date idea is going to an art exhibition um the beauty of like some art exhibitions is some of them are free where you, unless you're going like maybe opening night some of them might charge a small fee for your opening night but if you go to places like the alliance they always have like art displayed um some form of art it can be photography it can be actual physical um art it can be canvases it can be those like jewel kali metal ones so you can check out different art galleries i know there's like i'll put like a list of art galleries you can check out that are within like say nairobi but also in your area because i noticed there's like a banana there's the banana art gallery and i intend to check it out at some point the beauty of like an art gallery is that it's not going to set you back in terms of cash unless you choose to purchase some art um so you probably end up just thinking um just spending some money either on like drinks if they have an open bar i challenge you to go like opening night the beauty of like opening night especially if it's not invite only is you get to interact with the actual artists and they often have like an, a bar and you get to meet other people who are interested in art and you get to hear oh sorry that was a doo -doo. And you get to hear what people what different how different people interpret the art in the space so yeah go for an art exhibition or an art show uh, another note to that you can also choose to visit like the museum uh, which is like again a great it's like just connecting with art connecting with nature in a certain way you can go to a museum uh, it can be like those historical museums actually I challenge you um if you are someone who's trying their date ideas have you ever visited the archives like visit the archives i think they charge 50 bob unless that price changed and they have like a lot of stuff in there historical stuff there's the it's called murumbi gallery museum which is like point zero of kenya did you know point zero of kenya it's you see gpo there's that um it's called murumbi i think if i'm not wrong that's point zero so any distance to any part from nairobi is measured from that point if you want to know how uh, far kisumu is from nairobi it's marked from that point that's usually point zero fun fact um you can go for a staycation so a staycation you can choose to go to an airbnb where 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 uh-uh 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 they were becoming very annoying ah oh, yeah i was saying go for a staycation yes you can go for a staycation you can go to a hotel you can go to an airbnb just even for just one night just go treat yourself away from your home um away from your usual responsibilities i know most of the times like when you come home even if you're planning to just come home and chill and not do much in your household you'll always find something that needs to be done you either have to cook You'll have to clean or clean up after someone or find something like you might find yourself just going back to your usual routines. So take one night off, like take an actual night off, go to an Airbnb, go to a, um, a bed and breakfast where you don't have to worry about what you're going to have for breakfast. Like you're going to just spend the night, get that whole treatment, like sleep in a hotel room, you know? um number five is you can take yourself out for lunch um you can choose a restaurant like maybe a restaurant you've been curious about you've heard about like don't believe the hype go find out for yourself and just go for lunch a simple lunch just you can choose uh from high end to whatever and the beauty of like certain um date ideas like lunch you can have like five of them in the jar right you can have five different um ideas in the jar and then you can specify which restaurants you want to visit with each with each of uh of the notes so you can say uh go for lunch at like social house or go for lunch in akibandaski like you get to choose it's up to you you decide this is where i want to go for lunch or you can just leave them out as go for lunch and then you get to decide later on where you'd want to go for this said lunch okay that's number five so let's switch over to the at home ones we'll do five of them and then we'll switch back and maybe do ten i don't know um so for at home 
dates at home the first one you can try is you can try a new recipe and then you can also go in depth the, again these are those ones you can have multiple um, types so you can have try a new recipe so you can go online um, check out a new pasta recipe if you're looking for something quick a 15 minute recipe if you're looking for something quick if you are looking for something fancy it's like oh baked something something like look for a recipe you, if you want to try and see how to do like seafood look for our seafood recipe their dogs have decided that now the neighbors dogs are here like they're from the other compound and they have like six dogs so those six dogs are barking at three dogs that are in this compound ah, let me tell you today the dogs have their dogs have decided this one i'm a tulia the, the puppy is now chill hi they've gone so you can try a new recipe and um, you can pick this out like maybe if you want to do it on the, over the weekend you can pick it out like on a Monday so you get to go buy all the necessary ingredients you will need or you can even say like okay I have like if you have like a product in your house that you've never used for something or you only use for one thing and just like be like cheese recipes that are not pasta or pizza and then find a recipe you get me second at home date idea is you can do a full self-care spa day at home you start off your morning with like what you would want to have for breakfast you'd like go a bit all in okay don't 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 hesitate if you want to have a mimosa have a mimosa okay if you want to have a cocktail as like you know for brunch or something and then do like your hair wash day if you're someone who does the wash day thing is or shave your hair if you are someone who shaves their hair or color it and then do your skincare thing like try the 10 step thingy with the koreans or the whatever do a shit mask wear like something comfortable you know like silk uh gowns and whatever like just like do a, an all thing like and go all in right in treating yourself just at home do that whole if you have a bathtub soak like soak in a tub with a, like a good book some beautiful music in the background if you'd want to have a drink have a drink get where 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 who are you who are you eh where are you going look at you look at yourselves one two three four five six seven seven dogs seven dogs hey even them they're trying seven dogs <laughs> i'm refusing one they have seven hey Woo. okay do your whole like do a full body scrub like in the in the shower don't take like if you're used to taking maybe my shortest okay the shortest shower and note that i said shower not bath the shortest shower i can have is like 20 minutes so go for a whole hour okay do like the head to toe scrub your body uh, do a body scrub then do like a body you know this body conditioners eh do a body conditioner like by the time you live in there like you're, you're smelling good your skin is glowing you know do your shaving shave your legs shave your whatever shave your armpits do the thing like go all in like you're giving yourself a treatment but at home okay um the third one you can do is like you can say you want to do like pizza wine and a movie or whatever food you can have a wings wine and a movie wings and a movie if you don't do wine you just you pick a meal that you would want to have that you don't have to cook you can order um you can go buy from your favorite nyama trauma spot you can be like nyama trauma and a movie and then pick a movie that you'd want to watch and then come home take a bath do your skincare thingy and then settle down get cozy in front of your 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 tv and just enjoy the night okay fourth idea is you can make yourself a fancy dinner and dress up for it okay don't don't eat it in pajamas so you can look up a recipe or make yourself something that you really enjoy and then like go all out garnish do everything like serve it like it's like a four course meal you can do a four course meal three course meal like have the whole thing you have your starter you have your main you have your drinks you have your dessert like go all out and dress up for it that's like a cool way to just make, like you even enjoy having you like staying in your own space or you're, you're making your space special and making it serve you at the same time right fifth at home idea is have sunday brunch 
wake up uh, on Sunday, prepare like a couple of things for brunch. If you want to invite people, that's okay. Solo brunch is also fun. Do a Sunday brunch thingy, make your food and then take your shower like or your bath or whatever you want to do. Get a bit dressy and then do brunch, okay? Enjoy it, like savor everything you've made. Ah yeah, we are back to outsiding. <laughs> outside and you can choose to try a new restaurant so if you are like me and sometimes like for me when i want to go to a restaurant sometimes i'm so used to just going to the same place and it's because of like i know what to expect so you can challenge yourself and say okay i always go to java when i want to do like coffee um i'm gonna try at cafe now or i always go to at cafe i'm gonna try java or i always go to Kilimanjaro I'm gonna go to Al Yusra you get you you just try a different restaurant and see how you like the vibe do you enjoy it try their food that's that's how you discover new spaces uh, number seven outsiding you can try oh this one is for classes so it said try pottery or gardening number eight you can go to the movies by yourself Eh? do a movie date like look at the movies that are um, screening at the time pick one and then wake up in the morning or in the afternoon or after work go to the cinema buy yourself some popcorn some soda or water or juice depending on what you like go enjoy also um you can sneak in your own crisps because why are their crisps so expensive i okay i i sneak in my crisps i'm sorry oh sorry i don't i don't sneak in anything i don't i buy everything there <laughs> But like, buy some snacks, whatever, go sit down, enjoy a movie, then go home. Here's a trick. If you, if you don't know, um, if, you are, if you don't mind or if you don't have a lot of money to go watch a movie when they are like, you know, when they first started, you can look for those late night or early morning screenings. Because I remember when I was in campus, okay, no, after, that's a lie. After I dropped out of campus and then I had friends who are in campus and we used to hang out a lot we would go for like sunday morning screenings and we'd pay 200 bob for me movies where people come at like one and pay 1500 bob you pay for 200 bob and you just and then we would like split one popcorn and then because it's like 6 40 7 a.m in the morning no one's checking your bag so we would sneak in our own snacks <laughs> but just like if you wanted you can do that or you do like those midnight screenings especially if you if it's easy for you to go home and whatever or you live close to the movie theater the nema the nema if you live close to the the nema <laughs> like people who live next to garden city i'm like maybe if i lived in garden city because like garden city out of all the cinema halls i've been to the best if i lived next to garden city i would be going for midnight screenings and then just walk home <laughs> home midnight screenings there's hardly any people in there very few people you get to choose whatever seat you want so you get the best seats and it's like what 200 bob okay maybe now it's 300 but it's still way 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 cheaper than the actual like high peak hours screening times um go to the park for a picnic and by park i'm like you can go to central park okay they've kind of destroyed that because they're building some road or whatever the central park and uhuru park they're not they're not looking all that because central park is such a beautiful park and uh well it was such a beautiful park you can choose to go to like karura go to aboreta aboreta is like 50 bob if you go to aboreta make sure that the 50 bob is in mpesa because they don't take cash you have to pay by mpesa when you're at the entrance um pack a bag you know pack your picnic thingies pack a thingy with sodas some two sausages some sandwiches like something simple go to ololua ololua i think is 100 bob 150 and it's like it has like a whole thing it's in the heart of the bobs the current bobs the fake bobs because of course i live in the real ones <laughs> anyway like go to ololua um you can go to ngong hills if you are feeling like hiking you can pretend to do the fast whatever and then do up and then go back <laughs> but go to a park and do a picnic like be that interesting person bring a book with you okay just sit there or a puzzle or something just something with your drinks your whatever 
uh, enjoy, you know, like in a paradise lost or whatever. There's also these ones where they have, where like the ones we went to, it was called Ziwa. The one we went to for Kazungu's bridal shower. Uh, but like, you can go to such, like they're green, they're very lush. You are in touch with nature, close to nature without having to worry about, you know, others. And it wouldn't cost you a lot. You can choose a free park, a paid park, but I know most parks don't cost that much uh, in terms of entry fees and all that um you can do brunch at a restaurant there's restaurants that offer like sunday brunch saturday brunch tuesday brunch whatever day of the week it is or sometimes they offer um you can choose to have brunch before you go to the office or i don't know would that work what time do people go to the office I do, i'm sorry do like a weekend brunch or a public holiday type brunch like just look at restaurants and see what they offer in terms of brunch and then pick one and go for brunch uh, you can try an event, the sip and paint events. Um, look up and see if there's one that's happening. And then go sip your wine or... You should be sipping wine, you shouldn't be sipping. Like, if you're sipping soda and... Like, I think the fun of it is like um, trying to draw when you're tipsy. <laughs> but you can try a sip and drink, uh, a sip and paint type of event. Um, you can go for a drink or a cocktail and a book. So this is something that I want to try out. I want to go to a restaurant, order a drink and just carry a very interesting book and just sit there, drink my drink. It can be a cocktail, it can be whatever. It can be a coffee if you do not drink. You can do like just a drink and a book, okay? At a restaurant. First of all, it will make you so mysterious. Everyone will be like, okay, interesting. Like you'll become an interesting feature in the space because everyone will be like, oh, okay that's interesting i'm gonna make you very mysterious and everyone be like oh that person seems very interesting you know what i mean okay um one thing i want to do i want to check out a golf club i want to go to a golf club i don't even know how they work but i'm interested i want to i want i i, I want to know what the hype is about you know like how going to a golf club is like a big deal so if they have like an open day where they're trying to sell their packages to new members and whatever and they want to show um, you know what the club offers and what you get if you're a member blah 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 I want to go for one of those because uh, it's going to be like a tour and everything I assume I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do that Tell me if it's something you think you're going to do And then the other one is attend a concert that you would not normally go for So if you are someone who listens to a lot of like african music and um or you listen to like just mainstream music you don't know let's say okay let me just do a whole example type thing right um concerts that happen for me uh this is a good example hasn't happened probably would not but if say someone like rihanna was coming to kenya i don't care if she's coming to perform show lingerie or literally just stand up on stage and just look at us and go like hey and this is how i wear my lipstick i'm definitely showing up okay unless my pocket says otherwise but for rihanna she's like the love of my life i'm showing up okay but if her man's like his name is asap was putting on a show i would probably not be bothered i probably would not even know it's going to happen because i don't listen to his music um or whatever so basically now the challenge would be now going for that kind of concert uh go for a concert by like say a nigerian artist who's not tiwa savage because if it's tiwa savage i'm there but if it is which other nigerian artist that if it is another Nigerian artist that's not Tiwa Savage, then like the challenge would be going for such a concert, okay? Um, back to inciting, we're going to shift <laughs> gears. Another inside um, whatever is you can do a picnic in your own garden or your balcony if you do not have a garden or your mother's garden. Like you can just go for a picnic, set up a picnic, not in a park, but like at home an at home type picnic at least i have access to like you know 
a backyard a front yard and all that so you can do like a garden a garden type picnic this one if you're doing it at your mom's well you might have to involve other people like your siblings or your parents and such um you can choose to discover your neighborhood so like go for a walk walk around and see okay i live here i probably live very early in the morning and come back very late at night so what's around here on a sunday afternoon go for a walk okay um Another idea is to do another movie night, but this time you choose a trilogy and then watch all three films back to back. Or if you are a Marvel fan, watch like the Marvel films in chronological order. You don't have to watch all of them, but you can like split it into like maybe I was going to say three different movie nights, but let's just be honest, you can do like five different movie nights and then watch the different Marvel um installations in chronological order so from the first one all the way because you know they weren't released in chronological order so chronological order in this instance if you're a marvel fan you definitely know this uh, but if you're not um you're watching in terms of the timeline not in terms of which one was released first okay uh another idea pick yourself a cake or bake something bake i would say bake yourself a cake and like try a different recipe uh different sorry different flavors um do buy baked cakes and then do icing at home idea um you can do karaoke at, at home and you can do it with friends you can invite a couple of people you do karaoke you can do a game night um that's another idea of an at home date you can do like handmade stuff beadwork um like i make my I make my ninis, my my waist beads. You can choose that to be like an at home date for yourself. You can draw on canvas, or you can do you can do handmade soaps, uh, hand homemade candles. Like you can choose something that you can make with your hands at home for yourself, or even for your friends as gifts. Right? You can choose to declutter. I know some will be like, oh, it sounds like work. I know, but decluttering is very therapeutic because you're getting rid of things that do not serve you. So you are one, for me, I look at it as I'm making space for things that do serve me. So I'm not looking at it as work of, oh my God, it's going to take so much time for me to get rid of all these clothes that I don't wear. For me, I'm like, oh, look at me making room for the new clothes that I'm about to buy that I'm going to wear. Okay. Uh, you can choose to watch a childhood movie that you liked. So for me, I would probably be watching Parents Trap. You can watch the Home Alone movies. Like, you know, the movies you really, really loved when you were young, but you've not watched them as an adult or just spend time like watching cartoons. Have you tried watching cartoons as an adult? Oh my God. I'm like, it's so fun. So, so fun. Um, you can do a candlelit dinner. So remember that one where we do like three, four course meals or we were just making ourselves something fancy. You can now choose to do a candlelit dinner. Like you'll prep your food, whatever, and then light your candles, serve your food on the table and enjoy it. Okay. Um, another idea for dating yourself is you can buy yourself flowers. Sorry, you can buy yourself flowers or get yourself a gift like buy yourself a gift you know there's those things where you're like oh if someone wanted to gift me i would want them to gift me this gift it to yourself the idea behind this like some of them might seem like so small right but they have such an impact because if we want someone else to do it for us why not do it for ourselves please peanut we're not doing this we're not doing this we're not doing this get down get down i'm not even going to look at you get down peanut no um next idea i don't even know which number we are at now but according to this we are number 17 of at home yeah at home uh so for this one you can learn how to make a cocktail or a new drink um new tea new like you know an iced tea i'm giving options for people who do not partake in the jesus juice so um you can learn a new cocktail recipe a mocktail recipe a new smoothie recipe and then try two or three new ones and see hmm, okay maybe i'll be adding this to my brunch thing okay um then 
Number 18, do a movie under the stars at home with friends. You can buy movie under the stars. I'm like, find a projector, borrow a projector, do like a whole shit thing at home. Put something outside if you, this is if you have access to a garden, a balcony. Just lay something down, project a film on there, and watch it. Okay, go for a walk. Oh, I think we already said that. Number twenty on this list is write a handwritten letter to someone you care about. I know that sounds it's like oh, but I'm dating myself. Yes, but. As you show yourself love, you can also show people around you, people you care about, that you love them. A handwritten letter is like a really sweet thing. Uh, so if someone sent me like a handwritten letter, I'd be like, oh my God, this is like the sweetest thing ever. So I would want to do that for someone else. Okay, we are back to the outsiding. Okay, we had gotten to number 15. So you can do zip lining, you can do go karting, you can do the paintball pew 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 thing. Um, there's like a, right now there's like a lot of spaces that offer that, so definitely try that. You can do a road trip, um, maybe with your siblings. You can go visit your grandmother. It can be like you can make it a thing where it's not just like ah oh, I'm traveling. You can do it like it's a road trip. I'm like oh I'm looking at different things. Like for instance, if say you come from the foot steps or foothills of mount kenya on your way there there's like all these other things so normally you usually take like say two hours to go to your grandmother's place like for me uh nairobi to muranga to my grandmother's place doesn't take long right then decide to make it a thing um look at things that are on the way there um stop at del monte and do like a pineapple thing stop in thika and look at the waterfalls the 14 falls um if you're using like a different route go to like thompson like look at the things that are on your way to where you're going and then instead of just doing like a long one short trip there do mini short trips that will end up being a long trip on your way there or on your way back I think that would be like a really cool idea. You can go watch a play at the theater um, in a school near you if they're putting up a play. I don't know. You can go, not set books, like a play, like an original type uh, script. There are so many theater houses that uh, put up plays and these ones will set you back probably anywhere between a thousand shillings to like 2,500. I think the most expensive play I've ever been to, I think I paid two five or three K um so go watch a play you can do a comedy show uh kinatai kina unjoro there's like the nairobi comedy club thing kina butita putting up shows um you can go watch like oh in comedy you can also go for a live uh live recording like Akina, the ones that Kina Abel Mutua do, go for that. Go watch Njugush when he's doing his live recordings. So like do such. That that would be like a really, really cool date idea. Um you can go for a hike. An adventure type thing, right? Uh there's those guys called Akina Let's 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 Drift. I think that's what they're called. Um there's uh turn up travel there's Rioba, just Rioba, where she puts together trips. Cause I like, ah! uh, I want to go for one of her trips. Like this year, I have to do a Rioba, a just Rioba experience, and I'm manifesting the Cape Town trip in October. That's what I'm. I'm manifesting that one. Going to Cape Town with just Rioba. So there's the short hikes where they'll go hike for a day like mount longonot um elephant hill and such and then they have others where it's like a weekend getaway type thing where you can do um an experience where they go to like kirita and do a lot of different things or go to garindare and then they do like sleep in an airbnb and do something you can go to akinana nyuki for an adventure thang, thang. you get you, you see where this is going i think you you get where this is going okay go swimming Mimi first of all first of all what I need to do is this is like on my bucket list for this year this year I have to learn how to swim good news uh, there's a school close by and they've just built a swimming pool my thought process is I'm going to go convince them to allow me to learn how to swim from there like that's one of the things that I have to do so go swimming 
basically is what I mean uh, go swimming you can go to like a fancy whatever that allows public people to go swim there there's places like I know if you are not looking to go like somewhere fancy there's places like Visa Oshwal I know they have a swimming pool there that's open to the public where people just pay you can come swim go swim and then make a lunch thing out of it carry some friends carry your kids this one you can do like the whole family affair your whatever and then the final one on this list is you can do a full money pedi go for a full money pedi like they do not just your nails don't just get them nails done with the claws and everything like do the whole scrub the whole whatever and then do them nails same thing with your legs let them do the whole time the scrubbing the whatnots the huh and then on our final uh block of at home dinners did we we did not finish yes we <laughs> we we ended it at the handwritten notes you can do um you can draw you can do the they're called mandala where you you do coloring the coloring books the adult coloring books let me tell you those things are so therapeutic oh so freaking therapeutic get yourself one if you ever feel like you have too many thoughts going in your head pick up a coloring book an adult coloring book um i bought mine from textbook center they have them they have like different types different versions go get yourself one i have well now i have two from there um you can also do water coloring at home just buy like, like a basic set buy the paper chill in the house and do something get inspired go outside sit outside do something it's fun you can also choose to redecorate a room in your house like you know how you've designed your room of course i'm th this is me um needing myself plugging myself you can check out like some of the videos i've done like some makeovers steal some ideas and then do something in your house or just paint a wall and move furniture around like get inspired um to do something in your space like by changing things up and have your space be inspiring to you choose to wake up early and watch the sunrise or stay outside and watch the sunset like it sounds like such a small thing but it is the most beautiful beautiful experience like have you ever just sat outside may I remember when i used to sit outside and watch the sunset through the balcony it was so fun like i, I really enjoyed that so you can do that you can choose to binge a series find a series that maybe people are all hyped about or something like me what i do is like i i the things i enjoy to watch i will wait and avoid spoilers as much as possible and then watch the whole thing in one go because i honestly especially when they're doing like their final season when i know this is the last one and i'm not going to get another one i will wait until they finish all the episodes and then sit down and binge the entire season so you can choose to binge a season of a show binge a show that's already ended like how to get away with murder scandal a show that's like completely done um binge a new season an old season of a show and such okay and that's my list hey let me tell you i thought this video was going to just be like 30 minutes but here we are like i think 50 minutes later and we're still talking about date ideas but i hope that you've taken as many notes as possible if you did not you can come back and take notes later because <laughs> we encourage you re-watching videos because why not <gasps> why not but uh definitely uh tell me if you are going to try even if you're not dating yourself and you didn't have an idea of dates you can do like as solo dates i hope you've picked up on a couple and you will try them and if you do let me know you can tag me you can tell me hey i tried this date you can message me you can be like i went on this solo date and it was so fun because anyone who tries the whole going just getting a drink and a book imagine tell me how that goes i know i've done that before and i think that's why i want to do it again but now i want to try it like at different restaurants like because of those high-end ones you know where people feel sweet and whatever for some reason or like in a golf course like some fancy ass place and then just dress up go there just have a have a a glass of wine and a book and just be that mysterious person in that space for whatever reason because you want to be okay 
but like tell me which ones you try out and which ones you like the most um, yeah so those are some of the dates that I'll be going for uh, this year and uh, I will be taking you along so we will find out how this mysterious person in a place is gonna be I'm hoping that you're going to enjoy dating yourself if you choose to or going on dates as well with other people you can also do this with other people that's also fine I am going to see you guys back here in the next video thank you so much for spending your time here thank you for chilling with me hanging out with me now let's try and chase the sunset and take some photos have yourself a lovely 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 week bye <laughs> You can do better